I'd always made things with cloth throughout school and I always knew I wanted to be an artist or a designer when I grew up but the idea of studying textiles really didn't occur to me until I did my foundation course in Carmarthen. I arrived on the course thinking it was graphic design I was going to do, but I realised then that I was a much more natural maker and I enjoyed making things from, from fabric, from threads, and opened up the possibility of textiles being something far more unexpected and mixed media. I specialise in weaving and what drew me to weaving was the idea of constructing a cloth, the idea that I could take a thread, measure it, control it, order it and construct it into a fabric. It was, it's not about surface embellishment, it's about the, um, the integral building of a fabric which I, which I love. I've always been passionate about colour and I really like the way I can explore colour theory and colour ordering through working with threads. So there's something about the parameters of woven textiles um, that interests me. I, li I like the fact there's a certain structure that you have to work within, but then I really try hard to nudge at those boundaries and those edges and try and make work that surprises people and is not what they expect from the weaver. I'm a natural collector. I'm always collecting um, imagery from magazines and from books and postcards from exhibitions. I've always got my eyes open. Um, now in this modern world, the fact that I've got a phone in my pocket and I can take pictures all the time is really helpful. I'm always observing colour and pattern and line. What I'm mostly known for in terms of the work that I make to exhibit is my resin work. And so that's what I decided to make for the Gallery in the Box Commission. I'm encapsulating delicate textile structures in acrylic resin to make small-scale sculptures, which also inform large-scale public art commissions in glass.